What up everybody, it's your boy, this is my sneakerhead in the house, coming with yet another video. Before we get started, please hit that thumbs up, subscribe, comment, share, I truly appreciate it. This is another discussion vid on a topic that went around for a couple weeks in a couple of the bigger sneakerhead uh, channels. Yo Anti, J-Star, uh, Bullet RC, a whole bunch of other sneaker channels and sneakerheads talked about this topic. And I just want to share my opinion. And that comes to seeding. Um, basically what that is, is when either you reach out to a company and they send you stuff. But what more people are always asking about is, how do you get free this? How do you get free shoes, free laces, free items, free clothes, free shirts, etc. Um, some people, they do reach out to these companies and say, hey, you want me to feature your product on my channel? Or I like your gear, maybe we could do something. But a lot of the bigger sneaker channels, they're, they're sent this stuff because it's marketing for these people. For example, Champs, they send it to all the big sneakers, constantly sending gear and sneakers, just sending it to them. And most people are supportive and, and, and don't, you know, hate on those channels, but you'll always get those people and it drives me crazy that I'll put in the comment, damn, how do y'all do this? Man, I bet you they tell you, they send you this stuff and want you to say something some kind of way or want you to feature this product in some kind of way so you're basically a paid spokesman. People, first and foremost, when it comes to these channels, including my own, we do it for the love of kicks. Once I'm tired of showing kicks, I'm not gonna stop collecting. I may get tired of doing this YouTube thing but for right now, I have no intention of ever stopping. But I may get tired of it at some point. I'm still going to collect kicks and I'm still going to buy kicks with my own money. That's what all these sneakerheads have been doing. It's taken years for their channels to grow. They started it just like how I started it. Loving shoes, wanting to show the shoe. That's that. You got to put the work in. They're still buying almost all of their stuff and putting it on a channel for your enjoyment. It's not cheap. It's not easy making these videos, even something as simple as this takes time and effort that some people don't understand until they start doing it. So I really wish that these people would stop complaining when, or stop hating on sneaker heads and sneaker channels when they get seated things because they worked, for, worked hard for it. These companies noticed it and said, hey, we're going to send you some stuff. Let us know your opinion on it. Some of, the, some of the stuff they get, they won't even put on it, put on camera. They'll just not wear them, or maybe because they don't like them, not, not show them. Or they might tell you right on camera, okay, not really feeling these. Uh, the quality isn't that good. The performance isn't that good. Don't really like how it looks, whatever. And they're honest about it. They're not paid spokesmen or spokeswomen. They're not over here being, you know, mar you know marketing agents for these brands. Champs knows, okay, we send these shoes out it's more exposure for our brand and for most of us that like show big props and big ups to to champs for doing that for us regular sneak heads we may be more entitled down the line to shop at champs as opposed to a foot locker or a finish line or whatever because we realize okay we, we collect kicks we love kicks and champs is always showing mad love to us sneaker heads so i'm gonna go there instead of going to foot locker so it's uh, ultimately that's what Champ's goal is, but for us sneakerheads, our goal is just to show kicks, talk about fashion, talk about kicks, talk about whatever topics it is that we have in mind. I haven't been seated anything. I've gotten a free pair of kicks from a subscriber, and even that got a little bit of shade. I got a little bit of shade for that. A subscriber sent it to me, those Air Max ones, the BHMs. And you do this, we do this for the love of kicks. Once that desire is gone, we stop making it. There's been tons of sneaker channels that I used to follow religiously that aren't around anymore because they're either tired of making vids or they've stopped making vids or they stopped collecting or maybe they have other focuses, you know, besides YouTube because YouTube is not my life. YouTube is not their life. It may be some people's lives, and that's cool. There's a lot of people that are making pretty good money doing this, which is amazing, but this is not our life. Just enjoy the content. If you don't like it, you can push the dislike, or you can not watch the video. But anyway, let me know your thoughts below about seating. 
let me know if any of you have had any shade or even you know if it's not necessarily bad maybe you could just tell me your experience with being seated stuff and how people uh, viewed you or what people said down below all right another video is on the way thanks for tuning in it's your boy the smart sneakhead and a brother is out peace